guys, this is Summer, Van Life in Real Life. This is Tyler Segrist. How's it going? The Adventure Travel Guy, and we are here in his van. We are in Cheyenne, Wyoming. You guys recognize my van over here. So this is a way fancier version than my van, as you can probably tell already. Um, Tyler, can you show us your van a little bit? Yeah, so uh, I've got a sink here, and I've got running water. What I do is I have five gallons underneath there, and I've also got a uh, small one. I think it's only three gallons or four gallons that I can use for like a gray tank. Uh, trash can, towels, storage. Uh, it actually has hot water. I've got a water heater back here and a fire extinguisher just for safety, of course. Do you have a bath in here? Uh, no bath. <laughs> I, I can wash my hair in the sink if I need to. Yeah, look <laughs> at this, guys. Okay, show me your my favorite part. Oh, I'm sorry about all that. Favorite part? The oven? Yes. The stove? This. Yeah. We can make pizza in here. <laughs> <laughs> and we did yesterday. Yeah. Make homemade gluten-free vegan pizza in a van outside of Walmart. As you can see here. Nope, you can't see. Just kidding. There you go. Outside of Walmart. So that was pretty fancy, I thought. Yeah. This is this is the dream. <laughs> Got lots of food storage. So that way you can have all the sketty and pizza. <laughs> all you really need. And yeah. canned food. Um, a bunch of drawers that are all soft clothes, so they'll actually like keep themselves shut when I'm driving. So that way, you know, if I take a left or a right, it's not just gonna swing open. But then I put like locks on these guys. These are pretty cool. Because then if I like break hard, then they're gonna come out. So you know, locked. Yeah, check unlocked. this out. Hey, like, again, done. Isn't that cool, guys? I never seen that before. <laughs> uh, and one of my favorite parts, I got a table. And you might recognize this table <laughs> structure from the one in my van because Tyler helped me build it. Yeah. This is pretty nice. Uh, TV. Got two fans. This is like pimp my ride in here. <laughs> nice wood paneling ceiling. And there's like those window covers just pop off. They're magnetic. And then what are you sitting on right here? Fridge freezer. A freezer. I got ice cream in the van. <laughs> what? And he's got solar panels. Wow. They yep, look very. Roof. So that powers the fridge freezer at all times. Yep. And this? It's the Wi Fi switch. It's the Wi Fi <laughs> switch, y'all. Like, Wi Fi on. Wi-Fi off. And this is for the inverter so I can turn on my microwave, which Summer absolutely loves. No, I don't. <laughs> but for popcorn, it's great. Yeah. And then this furnace. A furnace, guys. Uh, yeah, and he's got outlets, plugs, all of the things. Even got a mirror. Oh, right there. Wow. That's weird. That's a weird view. Hi. <laughs> uh -huh. Okay, so tell me uh, just real quick when you left and what you're doing uh i left on the 7th of june it is currently the 9th right so a couple of days right. ago yep. so, from illinois yep and i'm headed to cash peak in idaho is my first climb i've got about 21 mountains to climb 21 mountains to climb yep. in the next the f two and a half months two and a half months and the whole goal is to climb mount whitney which you won the lottery yeah. for that's pretty so. exciting so he literally converted this whole van and what do you do for work uh, application developer for a healthcare organization in the Midwest. Okay. She loves it. <laughs> <laughs> uh, but you do it all remote? Yep. That's cool. Yeah, and he's got two laptops here and a TV monitor screen and Wi Fi. Just you could do your job from literally anywhere. Yep. Yeah. As long as there's Wi Fi. That's so awesome. And how long did it take you to convince them that you could work remote? Because I know you didn't always work remote. Yeah, I don't know. It's just like. I changed out because originally I was in a different position with my new boss and made sure it was clear that, you know, I'm either moving or working remote fairly soon and he seemed like he was alright with it, he wanted me, so. Cool, alright, um, and show us your shirt. Summit. <laughs> <laughs> okay, wait, oh, okay, important questions. How much did you pay for the van, if that's okay? Yeah. And then how much did it, like, generally cost? I know you didn't keep track of every expense. Yeah. Well, you so, made it because you do spreadsheets and I stuff. did for a while, but not the last, like, two months. So tell me about that. So, uh. I spent twenty and a half thousand on the van. And how many miles in what year? Uh, it was a little over eight thousand. Somehow I'd been in two accidents. Yeah. It's a twenty seventeen Ram Pro Master twenty five hundred. Wow. For twenty thousand? Twenty and a half. Twenty and a half thousand. Yeah. Twenty thousand five hundred. Correct. Okay. <laughs> so and then I probably spent like seven grand converting it, maybe eight. Wow, that's it. So, yeah. I mean look at this impressive well, all backsplash. Was done by hand. If yeah. If you hired someone to do it would be a lot more. <laughs> right, right, right. And you literally hand or like laser cut or something. Yeah, these, these were uh, CNC the routed. 
but like that picture down there, that's like a laser cut thing. Laser burned or cut. Is it called laser burned or cut? Either way. Okay. Anyway, very impressive setup here. Uh, let's see. Anything else to add? I don't think so. I installed cruise control. Yay! That was scary. <laughs> oh, and a backup cam too. Yeah. Yeah, it didn't have a factory backup cam and all this stuff, and it runs really quietly. It's beautiful. This is beautiful. Oh, and show us about this. Oh yeah, this, this one's pretty cool. What? Now we could just have a conversation <laughs> while I sit on your fridge. You sit on your seat. Yeah. Cool. All right. Cool. So, uh, oh, okay. What does? What's the most real life thing? that you've encountered, because you've, you've gone on some trips of this, right? Yeah. So, like, what's something that you don't want to share, but that's real life and that people wouldn't know about? I pee in my sink. <laughs> <laughs> that's a good one. <laughs> this here doubles as a toilet. And you've got a gray water thing, or whatever it's called, black water? Uh, Tank? If it's uh, for bathroom stuff, it's supposed to be called black water, but I usually just drain straight through the floor, depending on where I'm at, not always. Van life in real life with Summer Slavin. Nice. The adventure travel guy. Follow him on Instagram. He's got great pictures. You have a professional camera and a drone. Yeah. And... Okay, lots more coming soon now that I'm back yes. on the road. Yes. That's awesome. That's really cool. All right, guys. See you later.